At G Suite, we are obsessed with the idea that computers should constantly raise the bar on what they can get done at the mundane so that our users, your employees, have more and more time to focus on truly creative work. And today, three of our apps are on over a billion smartphones. And we have over three million paying businesses that use the G Suite. Here are three examples of recent early adopter programs that we've done. Each of these apps is something that was built for enterprises only. The Jamboard, AppMaker, Google Cloud Search, every one of these is an enterprise only product. Google Drive today has over 800 million monthly active users. I'll be making five announcements now. First, Team Drives goes into general availability today and it lets teams easily share content in their drive and manage the sharing. I'm pleased to announce general availability for Google Vault for Drive content. Okay, I see a few people are excited about that as well. Thank you. That's all very well for content in the cloud. But most of my content sits in on-premise file servers. What do I do about that? I'm excited to announce that we're acquiring Vancouver-based AppBridge. AppBridge is a company that builds connectors from on-premise file servers to siphon that content up into Google Drive. Google's machine learning magic will build a predictive model for who you are and your activity and serve up that file before you even ask for it. This is, we call this quick access. We rebuilt Google Hangouts with a focus on making teams productive. Completely rebuilt to be an intelligent messaging app for teams. But in the new Hangouts chat, we've added rooms. Rooms are a central place for team and project discussions. So what you're seeing here is the new Hangouts Meet, our enterprise solution for video meetings. The Jamboard knows that there's a meeting going on and automatically presents a prompt and with one click, TJ can join the meeting and present the Jamboard to the meeting. We decided that it was time for Gmail to have add-on capability because people were wasting simply too much time going from the primary work surface, which could be Gmail, digressing over to a distraction, and then by the time they come back, 20 minutes are gone. Now remember, he's still in Gmail, he's never left the application, and he's able to fill out the invoice entirely in there. Boom, he sends the invoice, and he's done. It was that easy. Well, we've seen many positive uh, impacts of our, of our move to G Suite, but one in particular I'd like to highlight is when we ask the question around productivity and productivity improvements, um, the, average, the estimated average productivity enhancement and gain per week was nearly nine hours. It's our Telo showcase the Gmail add-ons, and we've been working with a bunch of other partners to build out exciting new add-ons.